Oh, total beta mentality. Complimenting another male looks you look inferior to females. Never break frame. And that has 109 down votes. Damn, bro, we got a neck beard on our hands. Like, I don't know if this person is actually a neck beard, but starting something with a total beta mentality is a bit of a red flag. Hey guys, welcome back. Thank you for tuning back in. And welcome once again to some more neck beards. I'm so hyped about this. I can't wait to check out some more gentlemen. <laughs> My lady. It's gonna be a great time. Thank you guys so much for all your ongoing support. I really appreciate it. The videos are doing so well. It makes me very happy to see people enjoy what I make. And on that note, I hope you enjoy. I'm 22 and stuck in the body of an eight-year-old only creeps want to date me. Oh, no. I know that's not directly related to neck bits, but yeah. Only creeps want to date me? <laughs> icky, icky, gross, gross, yuck. You can now get a mini fedora for your man bun. That's beautiful. I'm so glad you can get a mini fedora for your man bun now. Why aren't there mini fedoras for everything? I've never had a more in infuriating conversation in my entire life, lol. What's the last song that you saved? <laughs> oh, something that you probably never heard of, lol. Ah, uh, so then tell me why you want to know so bad. Why do you think I won't know what it is? It's not what your average 25-year-old listens to these days, lol. Try me. Nah, you probably wouldn't like it. Oh my god, just tell me, damn. Why you want to know? <laughs> Just bloody show them. Dude, what's your problem? Haha, -ha, why should I share the music I'm listening to with a complete stranger? It's the simplest question, dude. I was just trying to start a conversation and get to know you, you know? The entire point of this app. Yeah, they obviously just don't really want to show you what they listen to. I don't know what they listen to, but it must be embarrassing or something. Hates women, still relies on mum to make dino nuggies. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Honey mussy chicky tendies. <laughs> okay, since this is a closed group, so my real friends won't see this one, let me tell you this. I kind of got into trouble being a bit kinky. Only a kiss, mind you, with my niece. But I was let off with a warning, but at the same time not allowed to see my niece for a while and is currently repairing my relationship. So, from now on, I declare myself to stick to 2D and not to call any further problem. Surely that's not real. I don't even want to consider that that might be real. Ew. That's a lot more than ew. I'm thinking of sending a former co-worker a text about offering her money if she hangs out with me for a few hours. Is this illegal? I'm in a dry spell. I was thinking I could text her something like, hey, what's up? I have a crazy question and it's perfectly okay Hey, if you say no, would you be willing to hang out with me for a few hours if I paid you? Is this a good idea? No, that's not a bloody good idea. What are you talking about? How is that going to end well at all, dude? Hopefully this got some comments and it actually convinced them to not do this. Because no, that's not a good idea. I can't believe I even have to say that. Oh yeah, the classic. I got kicked out of Barnes and Noble for moving all the Bibles into the fiction section. Ha 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 ha. That just takes me back to our old Nice Guy videos. I read that so long ago. Almost brings a tear to my eye. The people who hate on anime body pillows are the ones who don't understand it. Grow up. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I really do understand body pillows, but why do they have to have a picture of an anime girl on them? But if that's what you like, then yeah, fine. Wow, top 10 
and Sexy Neckbeards Part 3. Somewhere in an alternate universe. The top comment says, Hot neckbeards in your area. Click now. Only 10 kilometers away. Men be like, My wife must be Asian, short, submissive, cute, thick, a good cook, ready for you know what all the time, skinny, and with massive de hunker bahunka loose, and be looking like one of the guests from Little Nightmares. I feel bad for laughing, but yeah, I know what you're talking about. You must have massive de hunker bahunka loose. That's what we're all looking for, isn't it? <laughs> massive de hunker bunka loose. Offhand, has anyone else noticed Koreans and Asians are obsessed with taking a shower before, you know? Uh, that's not an obsession. Have you ever smelled your crutch at the end of the day? <laughs> Ew. Bri, have you ever noticed how people are just obsessed with being clean? Not me, dude. <laughs> yeah, that um, makes me want to take a shower just reading it. Hey, did you enjoy your food yesterday? I think you have the wrong number. Remember when I came up to you yesterday when I said sorry? I think you're trying to reach a different person. Sorry. Your name me so-and-so, right? Ah, uh, yeah, sorry, I don't know who you are. Do you remember I was delivering food to you? Oh, I see. Yeah, it was good. Thank you. I forgot to ask you yesterday, do you live alone? You look nice and cute. Would you like to hang out today? Ew, so that's like the delivery guy. Do you live alone? Ugh. That is terrifying. And also much less of a neckbeard and more of a creepy private message. A bird at a store. I bite women, only handle me if you're a man. Just a neck bird things. Ah, oh, little gentleman. Fedoras, a touch of class for any situation. Ah, yes. <laughs> like, to be fair, I don't think them wearing a fedora really changes anything. But it is sort of a shame for everybody else who wants to wear a fedora. Not saying I've ever wanted to wear one, but neck beards have kind of ruined it for everybody. You are arrive your local restaurant and you notice this young woman sitting alone, how do you open? With humour, an elaborate one, a hard one. Hello, seeing you I noticed your perfect manicure and the cross shaped earrings. Maybe you believe in God. I used to believe in angels but the devil is a fallen angel. Do angels drink apple juice? Therefore avoid two traps. Wow. <laughs> oh Oh God. <laughs> like these alpha male dating Twitter pages are so funny. I will teach you to be a true gentleman. Neckbeards after their misogynistic rant was countered by a well-written and sharp rebuttal by an educated woman. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> okay guys, I think it's wholesome memes time. When your mum comes home from a long day of work and asks who washed the dishes and cleaned the house. Me. <laughs> now you don't have to, you can relax. When you look back at your past and you wonder what you could have done differently, but then realize that the things that you did made you who you are now, no mistakes, only happy accidents. Oh yeah, 100%, no regrets. You learn and you move on. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, make sure you like, make sure you subscribe and let me know what you thought down below. The next bit sub Reddit is a beautiful subreddit. I always have so much fun on here. And I had so much fun today, and I hope you did too, guys. Today's comment of the day goes to Not Laura. My son loves your videos. He giggles every time he sees the little flying guy. In brackets, he's 20 months old. That is so sweet. <laughs> Thank you so much to you and your son for watching my videos. I really appreciate it. You guys are seriously the best. This is the best job of all time. I read comments like that, but they don't even really make sense in my head. I'm like, how can that be true? Like, there are actually people that watch my videos? Very strange, <laughs> but I really appreciate it. Have a beautiful rest of your day, guys, and I'll see you next time.